community members indicators say they're continuing their fight to get justice in the death of Stephen Perkins. He died on September 29th after being shot by a Decatur police officer. And in an effort to express their grievances and get answers from city officials, people packed Monday City Council work session. When they arrived, though, they discovered that Mayor Tab Bolding wasn't there and the people at the meeting not happy. News 19's Mariah Wiggs has more. Yeah, Stephen Emily Mayor Tab Bowling's absence from the work session Monday struck many people as negligent. Before that, several people in the community and pastors are calling for his resignation. Pastors like Patrick Tucker called out the responsibility of a leader to take the heat regardless of the circumstances. Several community members spoke before the city council, calling on them to do the right thing and hold city leaders accountable. Councilman Billy Jackson, towards the end of the meeting, called for healing and for the, quote, removal of the officers, all of the officers involved, and our police chief. When it can't, when when it comes to moving forward, Steve Perkins' brother, Nicholas, says every day looks different for his family. With each second, um, we just pray and, and stand on our faith in God to, to help us through. And uh, we rely on the memories that we have um, from time to time. That's hard, but Steve did a lot of good in this world, and so that's what we go on. I'll tell you what, um, as tragic as this was, they killed the right person and the wrong person. They wouldn't expect the whole city to be behind him or behind our family. And for that, our family says thank you. Now, News 19 did speak to Mayor Bowling Monday night. He says that because he does not have a vote, it's not mandatory for him to attend council meetings or work sessions. He explained that the reason he didn't attend Monday's meeting was because the agenda was short and nothing on there pertained to him. Reporting live this morning, Mariah Wiggs, News 19.